This is a one minute chart of the spiders for Tuesday, November 14, 2023. Another daily recap. Pretty interesting day. The spiders gapped up over 60 S&P points above yesterday's close and continued higher right out of the gate. And there were several levels calculated before the market opened this morning. Um, but of those, most of those the market just left behind as the futures just pulled them up overnight. And the two levels you see here were on the board. They worked out okay. The best thing would have been to be long from the beginning of the day and ride this thing up. But sticking to the rules of how I trade these levels, both of my trades today were on the short side. So let's examine how they worked out. As price came up into 447.48, short trade in the E-minis was triggered, but there was not enough pullback at this level to produce a profit, to hit the profit target of 40 cents or four points in the ES. So the trade turned into a fumble and was reversed at about 10 minutes after 10 a.m. So there was a little bit of about a little over five points lost in the fumble, but the loss was mostly made up by a base hit achieved with the position was reversed at that point. And the second level at 449.07 triggered a short trade in the ES, the next short trade. And at first glance, it might look like this one was stopped out for a small loss, but that's actually not the case. In fact, per the strategy I used, there was no indication to call this one a fumble and change the original plan during the entire time this trade was active. It was out of the money most of the time, but I never got the signal to change course. So after waiting it out for about an hour and a half, the spiders finally began to move as originally intended, produce a solid base hit as they fell back down. So that took both of these levels off, off the table for the rest of trading day. And those are the two trades. So let's take a look at the tracking log to see how this translated into profits. This is the first trade at 447.48. That was the fumble at the level, but produced the base hit on a reversal. The second level at 449.07 was the one that took a while to develop, but as you can see, patience paid off. It worked out a couple base hits for eight points and a five and a quarter fumble. So net net to about two and three quarter ES points. So not spectacular, but ending the day in the green is always good after a fumble or two. I hope you found this information interesting and helpful. Have a great day.